guys welcome back to my channel so today I come to show you how I blow out my hair using the tension method I currently have my hair in loose twists which I've been stretching with the banding method so I've taken them down and this is what they look like so I'm gonna go off camera and undo these twists then come back and show you how I blow out my hair. Also, I'm blowing it out so I can um, give myself a good trim. Um, you don't really need to blow your hair out every time you want to trim your hair, but I really just want to go in and get rid of a lot of the, the thin ends because of postpartum shedding, my hair has shed a lot. So I just want to, you know, give it some, give it a good, a good chance for it to sort of grow back properly and thicken out as well. So, so that's why I'm doing it. But generally I would just do it whilst they're in twist or just a little bit stretched with twist or braids. So I've gone and removed all the twists. So here we are. My hair needs a wash, so don't judge me. Um, so I'm just going to pin them up and then go in with a um, heat resistant. So before I go in with the heat resistant, I am moisturizing my hair using the Equibotanics Marula Oil Leave-In Conditioner. I'm then following up with the Equibotanics Black Seed Hair Serum. It also doubles up as a mild heat protectant, so it's okay for a blowout but not for straightening hair. So I used a bit on my hair after moisturizing. So this is the blow dryer that I've got. I've had it for a while now, as you can see, it's, <laughs> it's quite old. Um, it's got like only two settings. One's like very, very hot and another one's like moderately hot. So it's not really the best. I don't think it has like a cool setting, which would have been better. So if you have a blow dryer that has a cool setting, use that one. So what I do is with the tension method, as most people know, you basically just pull the hair taut and then you apply the heat down the shaft of your hair. Okay, so this is the first pass. <laughs> not too bad. So I'm just going to do it again. So it's it's easier to see where I need to trim really. Just about there. Or maybe there. So in this video I did a lot of passes which were quite unnecessary but I really just wanted my hair to be quite smooth and not very frizzy because every time I blow dry my hair it ends up really frizzy. So I really wanted more of a smoother and a lot and more of a stretched look. So you don't have to do this but once I'm done I twist it and then put it away. And I'll just repeat that all over my head. So I'm basically just doing the same thing as I did before. I've already applied the leave-in conditioner and the black seed hair serum. So I've gone and done most of my hair and I just wanted to show you the front because that's where I lost a lot of hair due to postpartum shedding. As you can see the front parts of my hair needs <laughs> a lot of work because that's where a lot of the breakage happened. So yeah, also don't judge me, my hair needs a wash <laughs> and my scalp is a bit dry. But yeah, a lot of the trimming is going to happen at the front. 
so yeah i just wanted to show you the state of my hair because um with this ayurveda hair growth challenge that i'm doing this really is the purpose because i really want to see how much i can grow my hair out especially at the front my crown also had like a lot of problems but it's sort of thickened up now as you can see so if you've not joined my Ayurveda hair growth challenge yet, please do. You can join by um, joining my newsletter because I send hair growth tips every two weeks. So if you're interested, definitely join. The link is in my description box. So this is it all done. Don't you just love blown out twists? I do, I love them. <laughs> they look incredible. So soft and fluffy. Gosh, I've left I've left one hair here that's not um one twist here that's not blown out. I'm just gonna do that now. But yeah, that's it. Thank you for tuning in and let me know how you like to blow out your hair. I rarely use heat, but I absolutely do love a good blowout. So thank you for watching and I shall see you in my next video. Bye.